it's Friday, nine oh five. I'll we'll probably go in about an hour, hour and a half. I need to fill my car with diesel. No, I don't. I need to fill my car with petrol. My old car was diesel, this car is petrol. I am so nervous, I'm gonna like mess it up. I know you can, the nozzles are different sizes, but still. Oof. I'm making a cup of tea now. It takes a while before my stomach's ready to eat, so I'll see. Maybe a yogurt or banana for now, and then before I go, I'll eat something proper. Perfect, so I'll sit down. Okay, that's actually a little bit more bearable. Um, I do need to take all my decorations down as well for Easter because we're coming into the spring. Oh, I'm so sorry. This is so boring. I'll see you in a bit. I need to buy new mascara. I have two hours before I need to get be down there, but I don't know. I might leave soon get myself a coffee, then I can go get diesel or petrol and then get all the way down there. You're dying. I'm gonna switch over to the other one and bring you to the car. So I'll see you in the car. Hey, so it's probably really loud. So sorry about that, but we're probably halfway down. It's, the, it's such a weird drive. So basically right now, it's like blue sky is beautiful, but it hasn't been blue skies and beautiful. Like, it's not actually blue skies and beautiful. Can you see it? The wind's crazy today. And like, all the trucks in the road are crazy. Like, they're swaying with the wind. But, um, yeah, halfway there. And I will see you later. Bye. So I'm at the range. I'll try and show you stuff. Oh. Everything goes white. I can feel the breeze. Euphoric delight. Only you and me. Boy, your honey sickly sweet keeps me coming. Got me. just at a service station at the moment I went in because I needed to use the toilet and then I seen that they sold pad thai I love pad thai it's unreal so yeah pad thai pad thai unreal got that and then I was like mm, there's a McDonald's here I normally don't I don't think I'm like near a McDonald's, like near enough to a McDonald's. Never really go into McDonald's. Yeah, there's no McDonald's near me, but I got a milkshake as well. Back on the road. I thought I had gone so much further than I did. I think I drove like 20 minutes. My aunts are out today celebrating my little cousin's 16th birthday. And my aunt ordered fish and chip and it came with one chip. It looks tiny. Oh my God. <laughs> Like, do you see the size compared to the water glass? Like, it's unreal. Anyway, I really should get on the road. I don't know why I'm procrastinating. I did want to go to the Asian market today, but no, I don't want to. Hey, so I am heading into Aldi right now. Yeah, I'm going past one, so I was like, oh, I'll go in, I'll get some stuff. I did want to go to the Asian market, but I'm not going. Well, I would have had to detour and I didn't want to. I just want to get home. But I need to get food. And this is literally on the way. So Sorry, I did not bring you in with me. I'm so tired. I didn't even cop on what I was doing. When I show you what I actually got, you're going to be like, what the fuck?
if you're wondering where everybody is on a really hot day in the summertime, this is where they will be. It's crazy over here. So yeah, if you are ever in Dublin and it's really hot, really sunny, come to this area. I need to show you what I got so I can put the stuff in the fridge. So let's do the not so fun things first. My leftovers, crisps, more crisps, milk, more milk, cream cheese, biscuits, hummus, lemon, sugar. I quickly made a cup of tea. I think I will start with the most random. They're just little sheep. And I know you're probably wondering like, what the heck? But I grew up in like, in a farmer's house and all I want for Christmas is have little sheep, little decorations on my tree. But they were costing like 15 euro for a decoration, just one small sheep. And I was like, no way. Now I've got these four little ones and I'm gonna put little hooks in them and then I can hang them from the tree. This, it is an ice cube maker, but I really wanted to get one that had like a lid on it, but I just can't find any. And I just wanted to get this now. I make like my sauces and stuff. I make them and then I freeze them. So I was thinking if I put them into here and then I can like push out all the ones that I need and then like refreeze stuff like that, just so that I can save a little bit of money. Okay, now it's time for the really fun things. It's a cup, but it's not just any cup. It's a, it's a, no, it doesn't tell me what it is. It's a double walled bear cup. Can you see it? So it's a bear in a cup. So it was so cute. Had to get it. I've seen them around so much and I loved it. And now I have bubble wrap. So I have loads of popping. And then this, it's that iridescent glass. And it's like a tall one because I don't have any tall ones, but it's this shape. So it's actually quite, cool and quite amazing. I think it'll be a straw drink, definitely. I am so excited about these. They're just so pretty. It didn't cost that much. And the amount of money that I'm gonna save from making all the sauces from scratch, I'm hoping I'll make all this back in no time. So I'm really happy with today. Really, really happy with today. The person that I went down to Carlo to visit is actually my granddad's sister. And she's not been feeling too great. She was in hospital a few weeks ago. But when I went down to visit her, she was out of bed and she was up talking to me and telling me loads of stories and things like that. So very, very happy that I went down because I was. I think most of my anxiety for the last few weeks has been about her and also with trying to get like granddad's memorial cards sorted, things like that. So I'm feeling a lot lighter today, which is so good. But I am going to watch TV, drink my tea, and you might have noticed this and been like, what the heck is that? But it's a little massager. So when I'm sitting down here, it can like massage my back as I'm watching TV. It's been so good. And I think it warms up as well, so it can heat my back as it's massaging me. But I just want to say thank you so much for being here. Um, I hope you enjoyed Carlo. I don't get out very often, so hopefully this is the start of me really exploring Ireland a bit more but uh, yeah thanks so much for being here if you did like it please hit the like and subscribe if you can bye